Okay, we're going to teach how to do teach a mouth exam. First thing you're going to do is teach a, tilt, a chin rest. So, chin, good boy. Just so that he can put so that he can put his head in your chin or his chin in your hand with a little bit of pressure. This gets them up over their front, makes them look all nice and pretty. So, teach this usually with a clicker. Just teach it separate while you're sitting on the couch watching TV. Chin, good boy. Chin. And it becomes a place of comfort to him. If he's nervous about something, he'll often come and put his chin in my hand. Good boy. Good boy. You want to highly reinforce this. So after the chin rest comes you teach a tilt. Tilt. Good boy. And again, highly reward that. Really reinforce that position. So again, tilt. Boy. No, you're fine. Nope. Good boy. Tilt. Good boy. It doesn't have to be vertical. You don't want to do that. Just a nice angle and keep your head out of the area. You shouldn't be part of the picture. Tilt. Good boy. Again, really re reinforce that tilt. Good boy. Tilt. Yes. Good boy. Good boy. Okay, after the tilt, you're going to teach teeth. Good boy. So you got a chin rest, we got a tilt, and then we're just going to teach just the, just the bite right now. And again, really reward that. Reward, reward. You'd be doing way more rewards than me, but he's pretty well trained. So tilt. What are you looking at? Tilt. Good boy. Teeth. And you do that, each one of these steps you do like a zillion T times. And then after tilt, teeth, show either side either side for occlusion. I tend not to move their head all the way around because it throws their off balance and they can move their feet. So again, final final product is we've got our dogs in here. Good boy. Chin in the hand. Tilt. Good boy. My head's out of the picture. Teeth. 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 And that's it. Good boy.